The following contest is your final resolution main event of the evening. About to make his way to the ring from the Serengeti, the Alpha Male, Marty Brown. He said he's not going to be intimidated when he looks across the ring and see, he sees the icon sting. He said he's been on the field with Dan Marino, Joe Montana, and Jim Kelly, and the former National Football League linebacker, the veteran of two Super Bowls, the alpha male Monty Brown. No, it's not about intimidation. He says it's about trust. He and Jarrett, they say it's about mistrust between Sting and Christian Cage. It's time to find out whether they can trust each other as we see the alpha male already in the ring. And yes, here's his partner. Introducing his tag team partner. Coming to us tonight from the Music City, Nashville, Tennessee. He weighs in at 235 pounds and is accompanied to the ring by Gail Kim. He is the current NWA heavyweight champion of the world and the king of the mountain, Jeff Sharon. Trying to put a wedge in between Christian and Steve. That's what he's trying to do. That's what Jeff Jarrett does. He plays mind games. Any way he can try to find an advantage. But you know, this particular match right here, it's not about world championships. It's about giving this man his just due. And I believe Christian and Sting will have that game plan all along. And announcing their opponents. He weighs in at 235 pounds. Captain Charisma, Christian. Christian Coalition, the man who has his group of peeps on their feet in the impact zone. He is undefeated in TNA. Captain Charisma, Christian Page, is headed to the ring, and Chef Jarek Monty Brown, you may have played some mind games, but when it comes to mind games, you may be messing with the wrong people in Christian Cage and in his partner, the legend the icon who's set for his return to the ring.
The question's now, how's he gonna be? But look at him. That's a man who was dedicated in getting back and he wanted to go out on his terms. And this is why he's come back to TNA this year. This is his year. Quite honestly, unlike any reaction that we have ever witnessed in TNA, unlike any reaction we've ever seen in the Impact Zone, as they just about tore off the roof. Wow. That, that'll play mind games with you, just that crowd reaction. If you're Jeff Jarrett and Monty Brown, you got to just block them out. Because they're not, they're not yelling, let's go Monty and let's go Jeff, I can promise you that. The Christian Coalition, very vocal behind Christian Cage. You can sense that everyone here, Don, realizes that they're sitting in on a piece of history as we see the alpha male level. Christian Cage with the shoulder block. They realize that they're watching, Don, a wrestling dream team unfold. Quick roll up here. Bonnie Brown's shoulders barely down for a one count. I'll tell you what, these two guys have gotten familiar with each other very fast here at DNA. And Christian and Monty Brown. And one thing that, that Christian has faced and, and, and had to take more times than most people, and that's that pounce. But yet he's lived to tell about it. And you know what? He knows how to avoid it. NWA World's Heavyweight Champion Jeff Jarrett now in the ring against Christian Cage. Shoots him off into the ropes. Jarrett misses first with the clothesline, then with the back elbow. But Christian puts on the brakes. How about that? A little Jarrett strut right back for Jarrett and then takes him down with a drop toe hold. I love how he just likes to mimic Jarrett and get into his head. Christian Cage and Sting, yes, they're going to have to trust each other, but that doesn't see. Oh, look at this. Jarrett not wanting him to get the tag. Christian it's Cage has the fans. Do you want him in the ring? Yes, there's the tag to Sting. This is what we've been waiting for. Here's the moment. Sting's return. Jarrett trying to figure out what he wants to do right here. He's looking into the eyes of somebody that's so happy to be back in the ring. Look at that, look, that stare. Not the same reaction for Jarrett. Side headlock taken by Sting. Jarrett gonna try and shoot him off into the ropes. And, oh, down. and Sting just took him right down. Put the shoulder right into him. Again. Leapfrog by Jarrett. Attempt at the hip toss. Blocked by Sting. And he hip tosses him right to the man. Took him way up in the air. Sting goes airborne with a drop kick. Questions answered, Don? Absolutely, I'll tell you what. I've seen some comebacks before, but this is unreal. You still got it! You still got it! Listen to him! You still got it! Letting him know! You still got it! You're damn right he does! Gonna lock it up again! No! Jarrett takes the shortcut, drives the knee right into the midsection, follows up with a series of rights, and now Sting's rocket. You've got to be able to block out that crowd noise, and Jeff Jarrett does it right there. He knows that no matter how you look at it, it's been a while since Sting's been in that ring. And if he can get some kind of momentum going, then he can use it to his advantage, but Sting not showing any kind of rust just yet. Double over Jarrett, Sting off the road, drives him down face first into the canvas. Here comes the alpha male in. Monty Brown, he's gonna get set for the ride. Sent off into the ropes by Sting. Double him over with the boot. And then the face jam, you saw Christian Cage from outside putting in the tag, the blind tag. He's now the legal man. I'll tell you what I like what Christian did is he got Sting involved early. Got the juices flowing. The competitive juice is working. And you can see the blows writing down on Jared. Oh! Oh, no, blow. Distraction by Gail Kim. Griffey pulled aside. Oh, man! Christian Cage driven out to the concrete, sent out to the arena floor by Jarrett. Wow. That was a tribute to Sting. You saw Christian in the corner. What, you oh, what a turrican run of my Gail Kim right what? there. She just snapped that off, and that's left Christian Cage in no man's land as Monty Brown's got him. Look out! Oh, on the rail. Oh, man. He dropped him. Throw first across that steel guardrail. And the alpha male gonna toss 
toss a weakened Christian Cage back into the ring to his partner, Jarrett. Gail Kim was the, the person that turned it all around right there. What a drop kick by Jarrett as he just levels Christian with it. Firmly plants both legs, both boots, right into the chest, and there's the strut. It's kind of right back in your face right there, and that's one thing if you're going to Make fun of somebody, be prepared to have it come back, but look at the fight in Christian. The rights, the lefts, from his knees and now back up to the vertical base, but stopped in mid-move by the alpha male. And Monty Brown takes him down. Oh, oh backbreaker across the knee. Quickly drives him down again and then just T-boned him overhead with the suplex. The strength of this guy is unreal. If he does the patented scream right at Sting and then this goes over to business right there. Referee Andrew Thomas letting Sting know he can't come in. He goes to the pin, no. Right back to the cover, and again, able to roll the shoulder in two. Monty Brown is relentless with these pinfall attempts on Christian Cage, but not able to put him away. Oh, look at this. Good quick tags right there. If they've got a game plan, once they got through all the initial, you know, the initial force of this crowd and the initial sting entrance in the ring, it's now Jarrett and Monty Brown doing what they do best. You're right, that feeling out process, that high level energy, and now Jarrett Drops down to the floor and oh man, caught him with the right hand. Quickly, Jared back into the ring. You're gonna come charging at him. Oh, nobody home. Christian Cage moves out of the way and Jared crunched against the middle rope. Cheap shot from outside by the alpha male. I'll tell you what, man, it was a wicked shot too and Jared saw it and he goes right down there because Jared's in pain down there himself. And this is the way for him to get his bearings and keep a grip on Christian Cage. Christian. He's got to try and move Jarrett. He's got to get all of his weight behind him. Get over to the side of the ring and get Sting tagged into this matchup. And you know Jarrett's going to fight for his life to not enable him to make the tag. Look at the hand out there. There's the tag. And Sting's in. The referee didn't say it. Oh, wait, come on. The referee did he not say it. got him. And now the double team on Christian Cage. Oh. Double front suplex by the alpha male and the king of the mountain. Jarrett and Brown dropping right across the rope. Pin. Two. Whoa. Whoa. Shoulder barely up, another pin attempt by the Alpha Male. And Christian uses his leg strength to kick out. I'll tell you what, Monty Brown's been relentless on these pin attempts. I mean, you kick out once, he goes right back at it. And you can see they're wearing Christian out there. They're closing off the windpipe right there, trying to cause him to not get in the air. And you can just see the spit coming out of Christian Cage's mouth. He can't breathe. Well, he's had his neck, he's had his throat draped right across that top steel cable by Monty Brown. He'll try and go for a suplex here. Takes him over. Snap suplex. One, right into a pin. Two. No. Oh, just in time. He's got to get a tag in to stay. Or these guys, especially someone with the strength of Monty Brown, will wear him down. Someone with the experience of Jeff Jarrett will know exactly what to do. He's trying to set him up for the pounce. Oh, but again, look at that. Just using tried to, his momentum. Yeah, tried to use the head scissors, extending his legs. Monty Brown would have none of it. Sends Christian Cage out to the apron. Quickly, the alpha male gets up to that middle rope and now going to try and bring him back in. Christian Cage fights him off. You can see Sting yelling at him. To just hang in there and find your way over here to get the tag. Look at this. It's just Cage is fighting it off with everything he's got on the strength of Monty Brown. Yeah, but those words of encouragement. Uh -huh. You gotta do what you gotta do! And in that case, it's called survival. Look out! Oh, Whoa, he can pitch barely balance. stand. Fighting, gnawing on the head of Monty Brown. Frog splash! He hits it, but he doesn't have enough to go for the pin. And at the same time, when, when he came crashing down with the frog splash, the impact that he, that he crashed down across the chest of Monty Brown did not enable him to go One, for the pin. Two. The arm. Just no. doesn't have enough. He didn't have enough leverage right there. He did not have the proper weight positioning. It was a desperation attempt. He extended the arm. He draped it across the chest of Bonnie Brown, but it was not enough to put the alpha male away. And again, he gets close over there to the tag, and Monty Brown pulling on the feet, knowing exactly what he's got to do. Christian Cage, not nah, look how close he is. They're leading out, and Monty Jared, Brown. Jared, oh, he's Jared got a cheap shot. Him. Jared pulled him down off the apron, just when it looked like Sting was going to make the tag. Oh, look at the music. Gail Kim is a shield. Yeah, human and look, shield. he goes over to tag him, and there's nobody there. Oh, no. And Sting back up, but no. Christian Cage tossed back out to the ring. Right here in front of us, Jeff Jarrett grabbed two chairs. There you can see he's setting him up. Again, Sting trying to get in here. The referee's not letting him. Look out! Oh, the... Able to avoid that concerto. And now, Christian Cage, he just double TDT to both. Now he's got to get the tag. He doesn't have any strength left. He's got to somehow roll up to get in there. Listen to him. There he jerks. He's got to go on gut instinct right here. Just he's... on pure guts. Christian Cage. Gonna try and slide, get your body anyway. 
Sting's got his arm, his hand extended in. There's the tag. No problems with the referee seeing it this time. And he's fresh. He's fired up. And look at those right. Look at that clothesline. I mean, he's relentless out there. One after another. In the corner. As he hits it. Stinger splash on Jarrett. Oh, he dumps on the Oh, no. Oh, no, the referee down. Contact made with Monty Brown. Now he's got him stacked up in the corner. The alpha male and the king of the mountain both. What's he gonna do, Monty Brown? Tossed out to the floor by Sting. He did it effortlessly too, as he just absolutely picked him up and threw him over. Now he's got Jared. Scorpion, turn him over. He's turning him it. over. But the referee is down. The referee is still down. He's got the Scorpion Deathlock applied. Jared trying to make it to the ropes, but you're right. Referee's knocked out. Look at this, you see right there. Oh, he, he got the rope, but the referee didn't see it. They pulls him back to the middle of the ring. Jared tapping out. Oh, Monty tries to come in. Cage cuts him off. Christian Cage. Oh, look at these guys just blow after blow. Jared's been tapping out for minutes. Look at this. Oh, no. Right on top of Sting right there. Christian Cage was tossed overhead by Monty Brown. And Christian Cage, just he just crashed right into Sting. Oh no, look out. Sting and, and Christian Monty Cage. Monty Brown's got the belt. Face to face, nose to nose. I mean, Jared earlier talked about this mistrust, trying, trying to plant a seed. Monty Brown with the title belt. Well, there's some trust for you. He pulled he him pulled out of the way. Away. He pulled Sting out of the way. Now the exchange, Christian Cage sends Brown out to the floor. Sting's got the title belt. Whoa, look out. Well, you can see right now, you're just anybody that touches you. He's got the belt right there in his hand. There is, a, is there some mistrust? Look at this. He drops it and goes right after Jarrett. Jeff Jarrett and Monty Brown, they planted the scene about mistrust between these two. But now they're working as a team, and they take the alpha male and drive him right into Jarrett. And now they're going to send Monty Brown out to the floor. That leaves Jeff Jarrett in the ring by himself, two on one. Who's this? Wait a minute. No. What is come on? Bobby Roode and Eric Young of Team Canada, the associates of Jeff Jarrett and the alpha male, they've now hit the ring. More of Jarrett's minions coming in here to help him out in his time of need. Impact 
and Christian Cage do it? I'll tell you, everybody wonders what he had in the tank. Well, let me tell you something. He took everything that they gave him, and he was standing, and he let it build in him, and it re-energized him, and look who's standing at the end. It's Sting and Christian Cage, and look at the crowd. Just give him this tribute. He did it. In my mind, he answered all the questions. And look at this right there. You see him holding that bat that destroyed, or holding the guitar, I'm sorry, that was destroyed, playing it. Jared can't believe it. We have witnessed the return of a legend, the return of an icon. Yes, go time. And he's just soaking in the moment. It's got to feel so good, and he deserves this. He deserves this moment. And look at this. In the ring right now, Christian Cage is holding the bat up in the air, pointing at Sting, and hands it to him. Look at this. He, it's almost as if he just said, Sting, this is it. This is your moment. And he did it. He answered all the critics. He answered all the questions. The face of TNA, it's changed forever. History is made at final resolution. <laughs>